Good morning, everyone. Well, today we uh, celebrate another saint that is uh, closely associated with St. Francis of Assisi, and that is St. Clair. Uh, St. Clair was born in Assisi, and is known, sometimes known as St. Clair of Assisi. Uh, much influenced, I think, by St. Francis, um, also very radically attached to poverty, uh, much like St. Dominic. Um, and as a result, uh, she established the order known as the Poor Clares that we know of. Uh, who who strive to own nothing, and in fact, at one stage, um, uh, that was was their purpose. They actually stated that they would never own anything, and the Pope tried to turn that over by sort of saying, "Well, no, no, you've got to actually take ownership of of something, you know, that, of the property that you live in, for example." And Claire resisted that, uh, so they always lived a very very poor existence, relying completely on what people give them. And we still do have uh, members of that um, um, religious group uh, these days, uh, known as the Poor Clares. Totally unrelated to that, we've got Matthew's Gospel, chapter 18, which talks about forgive your brother and sister 77 times. That is obviously uh, a biblical number that we've spoken about before. Seven is a number that is used, which is, means an infinite period of time or an infinite number. And that's why we talk about creation over seven days. It's created over a very, very long time, not necessarily seven 24-hour periods. So um, that gives a little bit of understanding of biblical numbers. So Jesus says, forgive people completely. And therefore, he, he gives us the parable of the unforgiving servant, that servant who was forgiven the debt by the, the, land, by the landowner, and then goes out to a fellow servant and says, no, no, unless you actually pay your money, I'm going to chuck you in prison. And needless to say, there was a lot of, um, <laughs> of, of, of dealing with him quite harshly by the, the landowner uh, who, who found out about this. Jesus is essentially saying, forgive your brother from your heart completely. Uh, sadly, that uh, some people have difficulty uh, trying to reconcile themselves with others. And maybe this is, this is an opportunity, so to say, well, you know, things are not going so well. But at the end of the day, let's, let's get things right. Uh, and keep things simple like St. Clair. You have a wonderful and a beautiful day, and we'll see you again. God bless. Bye-bye.